What is going on YouTube? It is Mr. Arrow HD and we are here with Builder Drift to Kill It. Happy Friday everybody. Uh, it's not Friday, it's actually Thursday because this is a special uh, Storm Island edition. I was just testing you. I was just testing you. I was just testing you to make sure, make sure that you knew uh, what day it was. Anyway, uh, before we get into anything guys, of course, we have to give credit to the song. Dylan Hardy's continue from our source, current source Argo Fox. Thank you very much again, guys at Argo Fox. Thank you very much to the guys the guy, I should say, Dylan Hardy. Uh, very unique song here. Uh, I'm not quite sure how I feel about it yet. I listened to it once, and I was like, oh, this is good enough to put in. Uh, and then listen to it again, I'm like, I like this a lot more now. But uh, let me know what you guys think. Actually, let them know what you guys think on their video um, and on social media and all that jazz. Um, so, again, we did, uh, we're doing a, a Storm Island car, which is kind of a difficult in itself. Um, because these, uh, this is the 4 Ranger T6 Rally Raid Super Off-Road Rock. Yeah! Ing! Yeah! I'm sorry. <laughs> um, this is like an off-road vehicle. So, within that context, it is stuck on rally tires. So, that alone makes it a little bit more difficult than, uh, anything else. This cannot be weight re uh, rate reduced, which, you know, sucks, but, you know, I when I was building, I was like, oh, yeah, it's probably not that heavy, you know, it's the stripped out um, thing. It's 4,100 pounds. That's a lot of hamburgers. Um, so I decided just to say fuck it, and instead of trying to limit myself and making a bad car and a car that's not fun, to just go ahead and go balls out on the power front. Um, just to see if I could make it the best I could be. I kept it the stock engine though, because I thought people would yell at me if I switched to the GT um, 500 engine. Turns out that may not have been a, a good idea. So, or may not have been a bad idea. This car, truck, vehicle, whatever you want, um, would you be surprised if I said it wasn't very good? Um, high speed drifting is not its niche. It's not made for that. It's not made for drifting at all, but at least the Mini, because it had so much power uh, and it was kind of light compared to this and a shorter wheelbase, you can kind of get away with it more. Uh, this truck does not like long or fast turns. Uh, the engine, I was looking at the power graph as I was building, I'm like, wow, this is really weird looking, because um, it didn't go up smooth, uh, especially after you add cams to it. Um, so I just tried fiddling with the gears a lot, and it never seemed like the gears were right for me. Um, again, I made two changes to the tune, you guys have seen both of them at this point. Um, it just never worked for me on longer corners, it just felt flat and really grippy. Um, but on shorter corners, or more normal turns, stuff off of Storm Island, uh, I can report that it's not as bad. Uh, I know it's raining here, but I waited around to get a thumbnail, so I waited until it was dry. Uh, on the rain, it's fine, don't worry about it, uh, it's great. Uh, but in the dry... It's a little bit grippy, however, it transitions very well for how much how much it weighs. Uh, I think this thing looks badass, honestly. If you can ignore like the snorkel and like the weird exhausty hole things on the side, uh, I think it looks friggin' cool. Um, I don't know, maybe it's just because I murdered it out or whatever, but yeah, I think it looks really cool. It sounds really cool. Um, well, it doesn't sound really cool. It sounds like a V8. It's not like anything special. Um, but yeah, it's better on like more normal corners and stuff than like, this high speed, whatever. So if high speed drifting, whatever is not your thing, you may have more luck with this. But uh, I like something that works a little, at least decently everywhere. And on those high speed turns, I was not having fun at all. It was just super grippy. Um, so if you guys want to give it a whirl, uh, of course it is on my storefront, uh, the amended version. So with the one with the two tweaks that you saw. Um, again, I wouldn't recommend it using on Storm Island. On the dirt, actually, it is a handful. It feels like it's got like, more power, more than enough power than you need, which is weird. But, um, yeah, so if you guys want to give it a whirl, of course, it's always on my storefront, along with everything I post on the YouTube. So thank you guys very much for watching, and I'll see you next week. Take care. Happy Thursday. Potatoes. Hey, thank you so much for watching. If you liked the video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more of my videos, go ahead and click that subscribe button. I also have a Facebook and a Twitter. For those links, be sure to check out the description box below.